Oh my god, the warden has completely lost his mind. Oh, this is not good. He's- okay. I knew he's nuts before- okay, he's long gone. Oh god, okay, I need to find Timmy. I need to go and find Timmy. I need to tell him everything about this. So we can try to put together a plan and see what we can do about this next, cause... Wait, what? I wonder where Jaylene went to. It was like some kind of witch. Just vanished. Well, uh, wait, am I still invisible? Warden? Okay, okay, I'm still invisible. Oh my lord. Oh jeez, okay. Okay, might be a good idea if I don't use this disguise anymore. Or should I? Hmm. Huh. I really don't know, man. I don't know, but I just need to go and find Timmy. I'm gonna go find Timmy and just get out of here. I, I, I can't be seen around this warden anymore. I can't. I just can't do it, and I won't do it. I'm out of here. Oh! Oh! Wait, Katie? Oh, jeez. Oh, man. This isn't good. Um, Katie, get out of here. You don't want the warden to see you. Oh, it's too late. Oh, my God. He's gone nuts. Oh, no. Oh, wait. I can't say. Katie, did you happen to see a female prison guard? Oh, boy. I can't warn her either. How do I? I can't. <clears throat> oh, no. I can't do anything. Get out of here, Katie. Don't be seen around the warden. Oh, the one who was flirting with my Timmy? Wait, what? Me? I wasn't flirting with Timmy. It was the other way around. Timmy was flirting with me. D God dang it, Timmy. What? My Jaylene would never. Yeah, exactly. I, I really wouldn't. Wait, why am I... Why am I talking like I... Oh my lord, this is so weird. Katie? Oh, why am I... I can't even contact with her. She, you need to get out of here, Katie. Oh, she won't now. Beth told her to stay away from Timmy and Jay. Yep, I remember that. Oh man, that was awkward. I miss Beth so much. Why Jay? What? Because I'm awesome, duh. Dude, don't be so insultive, bro. I mean, look, well, actually, without all the makeup, why am I talking to myself? I don't even need to be saying anything right now. Oh, jeez. Why do you think? <laughs> man, I miss Katie. She's so, like, pizzazzy. Why do you think? Duh. Oh man, I gotta fix all this. I gotta get Katie and Timmy back together. So, Jay and Beth, huh? Hmm, interesting. Wait, wait, wait. Why is that interesting, Warden? What? Oh no, he's onto us. Wait, this is what he. Mm, cute, isn't it? Anyway, I better go find them. Bye, Warden. What the? <sighs> yes, you go, Katie. Thank you so much. Don't, don't believe a word he says, Katie. Don't believe him. What the? Oh my god. What is the warden thinking? What is he even planning now? Oh jeez. Okay. He already knows. The warden already knows. But wait, wait. Hang on a second. Wait. He couldn't have known this before. I mean, because... Jaylene... Wait, I mean me. Wait. Oh god. Well, I wasn't even here the last time. So, I mean, how can this... How does... I wasn't here, so I couldn't have interacted with... Oh, this is so confusing. Timmy, I need to find you, bro. I need to find Timmy, get this sword, I need to get the heck out of here and just figure this out. Oh lord, okay Timmy, I'm coming for you bro. Oh man, oh, I'm, I feel like I'm having a panic attack here, I'm just trying to piece all this together, so... Okay, hang on. Oh, where's Timmy man, I need help with this. Okay, anyway, so... If Timmy, I mean not Timmy, the warden... Now, now the warden knows about me and Beth. But I mean, how could that have happened before? Because, like, I'm Jaylene now. And the way that it happened now is I was out in the courtyard and Timmy started flirting with me. But then Beth and Katie thought that I was flirting with him. And that's how, that's how the warden knows. Because Katie just told the warden about me and, me and, well, Jaylene and, and Jay and, Be oh, this is so confusing. But how does that work? Does that mean that I changed the past? Because this couldn't have happened before. I mean, I would have remembered it. Wait, would I? Oh, I don't even know, but now the warden knows. He's getting out of hand. Oh, this is not good, man. Oh, come on. Oh, Timmy, where are you at, dude? I need you, bro. This is not good. I need your help with this, man. Oh, the warden, he knows now, but he didn't know before because, I mean, this couldn't have happened before. This, wait. Oh, oh, Timmy. Timmy. Wait, Timmy. Can you see me? Timmy. 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 Oh, you can see me. Oh, oh, thank God you can see me. Oh, man. Dude, I'm so glad you're here, bro. Listen, okay, I found Thumper. Eh, everything's all messed up, dude. Eh, it's all messed up. The Warden, he, he knows about me and Beth. He knows already, man, he knows. But how could that have happened? Uh, there's no way that he could have known about us already. I mean, 
Not before. Not, not, not after this. Oh, I'm so confused, man. I'm so confused. How does he know? How, how does he know, man? Okay, slow down. What happened? Oh, okay, okay. So, I... Oh, man. I went on the date with the warden. Thanks, Timmy. I remember that. I went on the date. But then, during the date, like, just halfway through the date, I went invisible. I went invisible somehow. He couldn't see me. He was freaking out. He's like, Jaylene, where are you? And I was like, bro, I'm like right in front of you, fam. And he just, he just couldn't see me at all. It was super weird. So I was about to leave and then Thumper and Seamus show up. Like Seamus looks like he's arrested Thumper. You know what I'm saying? Like he pu he's pushing him in. He's like, Seamus is like, yo, I found Thumper. And I'm like, what? I'm like, what? So then the warden kicks Seamus out of the room. He's like, yells at him. He's like, get out, Seamus. And so he kicks Seamus out of the kitchen cafeteria area and then Thumper and the warden start talking with each other. They start talking with each other because then the warden told Thumper that he knows that I'd come to Thumper. Remember when I came to Thumper for help about Jason? Do you remember that? When, I, when He knew about, you know, the person who framed me. The warden somehow already knew about that, dude. He knew. He knew about it. How could he know that, Timmy? How could he know, bro? I don't understand, man. How does he know all this kind of stuff? It's so... It seems he's a lot smarter than we thought. What else? Okay. Oh, man. I'm kind of freaking out here. <sighs> okay. Then Thumper... Thumper left. Yeah, Thumper left. They had this big, long, weird discussion. So Thumper left, and then... Oh, uh... Katie. K Katie came in. And, um... She came in, and the warden had to talk to her. But Katie told the warden about me and Beth, dude. He told... She told him. It's really not good. She kind of blabbermouthed a little bit. I'm just saying. What do you mean, told him? Katie would, was no snitch. Dude, listen, I was there. Uh, no, no, dude, it wasn't like a snitch. Okay, she wasn't like, yo, warden, I have inside scoop. She didn't mean to run into the warden. She tried to get out of there. She was talking about how Beth told me, like, as Jaylene. You know, like, Beth was talking to me as Jaylene in the courtyard. That um, Beth came up to me and was like, don't flirt with Timmy or whatever. Okay, so, no, 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 hang on. So, that's what Beth said. She told, she she went off at me for flirting with you, the, the, the previous you. And they had to stay away from me. The the previous me. Oh, it's just so confusing. <sighs> but so that's what happened. Because the warden was like, where's Jaylene? Oh, it's so confusing. Oh, oh, oh no. This is why we weren't meant to come back invisible. Wait, what? W what do you mean, man? What do you mean? I don't understand. Wait, wait, hang on a second. Oh, God. Has me being Jaylene, like, changed the past? <laughs> Dude, I thought we were only supposed to change certain things. Like, you know, a specific point in time between me and Thumper and stuff. This, we're, we're in over our head here, man. We're in over our head. What are we going to do about this? Well, that was the plan. But now I think you being Jaylene must have changed everything already. Oh, well, jeez, dude. Well, whose idea was that, huh, Timmy? Whose idea was it in the first place? But, wait, hang on. Could this have changed it for the better, though? Or the worse? I don't understand if, it's, if this is a good thing or a bad thing. Because, I mean, maybe it maybe it's made things better, dude. Maybe this could have actually done some good. Well, it hasn't changed our meeting and traveling back in time, so the main objective remains. What? I don't... Oh, it remains the same. Oh, okay. I don't understand that, man. Okay, just give me a second. <sighs> okay. So, okay. What do we do now, man? What do we do now? Do we need to check to see what's changed? Do we go back to the to the present? Because we've been here for a while, man. Remember, you said that we couldn't be back here. No, let's go back to the present and get some rest first. Oh, okay. What's changed already, we can't undo. Oh, okay, that kind of actually sounds pretty terrifying, man. Not gonna lie. I really hope we haven't messed anything up too much, but... Sure thing, man. Look, look you, knew, you still know way more about this time travel stuff than I do, so I'm just going to take your lead, but... Hang on, hang on. If we did mess things up, couldn't we just go back in time again and tell ourselves not to do the Jaylene thing? That way I wouldn't have to get up in this dress. Oh, please let that be the case. I don't want to have to go through this. Well, I already did, but... Ah. We would end up in an infinite loop of time trying to stop the changes. Oh, man. Okay, fine. I don't... Okay... What do you mean by an infinite loop, though? I mean, 
that doesn't really make any sense. Does that just, would that just mean we just keep coming back and back and back and back to make all the differences, changes to the differences to the changes and stuff, trying to change things? I'm confusing myself now so much. What I'm trying to say, does that mean that we have to keep coming back continuously to undo all the changes that we've made by accident? You know, if we screwed things up? Yes, it would never end. We would stop some changes, but only to cause others. What? Oh, man. Oh, jeez. Okay, fine. Listen, man, I am done with being dressed up as Jaylene for now, okay? It's funny. For the first five, ten minutes, I get it. Ha ha. But things have gotten way too out of hand. Let's just get back to our own time. I could definitely use a nap and some food. Some definite food. So fine, bro. Let's just get back to the present. Hopefully, we haven't screwed things up too bad. Oh, man, it feels so good to finally be out of that, that Jaylene. Oh, my God. Oh, hey, bro. How's, how's old Timmy doing? Well, current Timmy. This present Timmy. Oh, man. You don't understand, bro. It feels so good to be out of that Jaylene uniform, man. You don't understand. No more lipstick. No more makeup. I'm a free man. <laughs> oh, 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 snap, dude. I, I almost forgot to tell you as well. So, okay. You know when I told you that the Warden and Thumper, they were talking and stuff, right? Well, it turns out the Warden was behind everything. He's behind everything. Like, I know that we've kind of already known that. And we're kind of putting the pieces of the puzzle together. But listen, man. He's the reason. He is the reason that Thumper, you know, Thumper was finding out all this information about, you know, me. He was actually telling Thumper to find out who I love. Like, who I care about most. How messed up is that? So, he was telling Thumper to find out who I, about, who I care about the most, so that then Thumper could kill them to get at me. So, so then, so then, if that's not bad enough, right? He says all this, and then he says that Thumper needs to kill the person I love, and that when he does it, he didn't say this to Thumper's face, but he admitted when Thumper left, he said that the reason he's doing it is so he can blame Thumper. So that he, he'll he never get blamed for it. The Warden can get away with all of it. And they can carry out his plan of taking over the world while I while I hunt down Thumper. So he's, his entire plan was to get at me, kill Beth, make me angry about it, make me concentrate completely on Thumper. So while he took over the entire world and the entire city with this Doby clone army, I was chasing Thumper this entire time. So he can get away with it. Wow, he is clever, huh? But now we know this. He's not clever, man. Don't... Well, I mean... I guess he is. I guess he is. But w w wait, what? What? W hang on, sorry, what? W we know what? Uh, what? It might not need to be a specific point in time between you and Thumper. Wait, so... W w wait, what do you mean? What, what point in time could it possibly be, then? That doesn't really make sense. Wait. Uh, perhaps one between Thumper and the Warden. Oh... Oh, you little genius, Tim Tim. Tim Tam. You little Tim Tam. Tammy. I'm going to call you Tammy. Somebody told me to call you Tammy. So I'm going to... Tammy? What are you doing, Tammy? <laughs> I'm sorry, Tim Tim. I'll call you Tim Tam. Timmy Tim Tam. Tim Tam Tam. But... <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. But hang on. Listen, listen. But why would we do that, though? You know, like... The Warden and Thumper, they work together all along. So that's going to be a little bit, that's going to be harder to find a point in time with those two, don't you think? Yes, but if we change that somehow, it would stop Thumper. But, but, uh, what do you, hang on, what do you mean if we change that somehow? That, wait, hang on, that would only save Beth though, dude. Think about, dude, Billy and Katie and, and everyone else, man. Don't forget about them. That, we got to remember about that, dude. So, I mean... Would us splitting up the Warden and Thumper save them as well? Because we can't forget about them, man. Not Billy and Katie. Especially Katie, bro. I think so. Because the Warden's plan relied on Thumper. So, the Warden's plan... Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I get you. Wait, but hang on a second. Hang on. How... If we wanted to do that, how could we possibly see if that's worked? How will we know? How can we know if that's worked or not? If we split them up, we then go back to the day that they died. Then watch and see what changes. 
Oh man, dude, are you sure that's a good idea? Bro, that's that's <laughs> think about what you just said, man. I know that you're the future Timmy and you've had a long time to think about this. But think about this Timmy, man. Think about present Timmy. Do you think he can handle seeing that again? Twice? And I mean, dude, what if that doesn't work? What if it doesn't work though, man? Did you think about that? Then he was traumatizing and we'd have to go back again. We would need to start again. So, it would be best if we get it right the first time. But, oh. Okay, man. But hang on a sec. Just hang on. Just wait. Okay. Don't, don't, don't go jumping ahead. Don't get too ahead of yourself. Okay. Because how will we know what to change? You know, with the, with the warden and, and Thumper. We have no idea what happened or, or what they were planning at any specific point in time. I mean, other than that, you know, when we were there, we seen what they were planning. But that's all we know. We don't know anything else. So how else are we supposed to find out other information about this, man? We're taking a huge risk here, dude. A massive risk. I understand what you're saying, but... I don't understand, man. How are we supposed to know this, man? Or how are we supposed to figure it out? We will need to split up. Each one watch one of them. And then pick a moment to change. So we just... So we're going to split up again? Oh, man. Uh, I guess so. But well, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. What about the timelines, dude? Bro... If they disrupt again, like last time, if, if things go all gloobity globbity and they glitch out, I ain't... Bruh, won't that cause any more changes? I ain't dressing up as no girl again, dude. If that happens, you're, you're becoming Tammy for real next time, okay? That is a good point. We'll need to power down the cloning machine source. Oh, yeah. But wait. Oh, boy. Oh, oh, oh. You tried that, remember? And that's what made you go... That, that's what made you disappear, man. But... Oh, okay. Fine, 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 fine. But hang on. Wouldn't changing that, would that make any changes to the past? Changing the cloning machine? Because the, the warden was working on that, remember? Yes, but we have no choice. It will likely only delay the cloning. Oh, uh, actually, yeah, that actually does make a lot of sense. That does make a lot of sense. Because that's all the warden was doing. He was just creating clones of poor, innocent Dobie. Oh, man. Okay, so hang on. But, dude, we just got back here. I kind of like it here. Ah, <sighs> so hang on. What you're saying is now we have to go back. Like, back, back. We're going to go back. Stop the disrupting. So we're going to take down the cloning... The, the power source underneath the cloning machine device thingamajiggy. And then we stalk the warden and Thumper at the exact same time. And then change the past? Are you sure that's going to work, man? <sighs> yep. Are you ready? Do you want your Jaylene costume for good luck? No, dude. No. I'm I'm not wearing that thing again, okay? I'm going as normal, Jay. I'm not going to be seen. We're going to stay invisible. But yes, dude. I'm ready. Let's do this, man. I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's go. So that's it for this episode, guys. I really do hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Parkside. What do you think is going to happen next? I'm so glad to be out of that Jaylene costume. It's just... No. No more. Never again. Done with it. No more. Let me know what you guys thought of this episode by leaving a like on this video. It really helps me out a lot. It lets me know that you guys still enjoy these episodes and this whole entire series. Another way if you want to get going and being extra supportive is down in the comment section down below. And if you want to make sure you let me know that you made it to the end of this video, comment that giant secret comment that you see above my head right there. Have you done it? Go on, do it. Quick. I'll give you a second. There you go. That'll let me know that you made it to the very end of this video. Guys, thank you so much for all the support on this series. I really do appreciate it. But don't forget to stay tuned to see what's going to happen in the next episode. Will we stop the Warden? Will we stop Thumper? Will we get everybody back? Only time will tell. Thank you guys so much. Keep your beautiful faces awesome as always. And I will see you guys next time.